Hi friends, it's Hazel's mom. I thought today that you and I could explore this help. Hazel's mom, can you help me? Oh, <laughs> hi monkey. Sure, I can help. Um, well, I'm not a monkey. I'm a chimpanzee. Oh, gosh. Uh, I'm sorry, chimpanzee. I didn't know that there was a difference. Oh, yes, there are lots of differences. But a really easy way to tell the difference between a monkey and a chimpanzee is that monkeys have tails and chimpanzees don't. See? No tail. Oh, I, I do see. Yeah, are there any other differences? Yes, there are lots of differences. But right now, I can really use your help finding my friend. Oh no, your friend is missing? Yeah, I can't find my friend anywhere. Can you and your friends help me find him? Yeah, I mean, I think we can help. What do you think, friends? Do you think we can help the chimpanzee find his missing friend? Yeah? <laughs> Great! Okay, chimpanzee, we're ready to help. Great! Let's go! All right, chimpanzee, we're ready to help. So who is the friend that we're looking for? His name is Fred. Fred? Yeah. Okay, well, does Fred look like you? Oh no, he's not a chimpanzee. Oh, okay, well, what kind of animal is he then? Um, I'm not really sure. <laughs> You're not sure? Okay, well, what does Fred look like? Well, let's see. He's big and covered in black and white fur and, um, oh, he loves to eat bamboo. Hmm. Okay, friends, so we're looking for a big animal who is covered in black and white fur and loves to eat bamboo. Hmm. Who do you think that could be? Huh. A panda? <gasps> yeah! Pandas are big and they're covered in black and white fur and we know that they love to eat bamboo. <laughs> All right, so we're looking for a giant panda. All right, friends, I think we can do it if we work together. Yeah, teamwork is the best way to solve a problem. Chimpanzee? Ch chimpanzee? Oh, where, where did that silly chimpanzee go? Well, if we're gonna find a panda, we better get started. Let's go, let's go this way, come on. I wonder if Panda came to the pond for a swim. Oh, oh hello there. I'm Hazel's mom and these are my friends. Hey, can you help us? We're looking for a giant panda. Are you, are you a giant panda? Me? No, silly, I'm a hippopotamus. Can't you see how big I am? I'm the third largest land mammal after the elephant and the white rhinoceros. The third largest? Oh yes, I can weigh up to 9,000 pounds or 4,000 kilograms. Oh gosh, that's really big. Well, it's very nice to meet you, hippopotamus. Um, we were wondering, have you seen Panda anywhere? Yeah, his friend the chimpanzee is looking for him and can't find him. Hmm, I don't remember seeing him, but maybe you can ask Elephant. She's right up there and has a really great memory. Oh, 
Okay, well, thank you, hippopotamus. You're welcome, and good luck. All right, it looks like we need to go up to see if we can find the panda. Let's go. Whew. Oh, <gasps> excuse me, elephant. Can you help us? Sure, just a minute. I'm still eating my lunch. Oh, sure, we can wait. Excuse me, elephant, but are you done yet? It's It's been a really long time. Oh, I'm sorry. Being the largest land mammal, I spend 12 to 18 hours a day eating. So I tend to lose track of time. 12 to 18 hours of eating? Wow, that is really impressive. What do you eat all day? Thank you. I eat lots of things like grass and plants and fruit. Oh, I love fruit. Hmm, now I'm hungry again. I better go find a snack. Wait, wait, before you go, uh, can you help us find someone? Oh, sure, of course. Who are you looking for? Well, we're looking for Panda. Yeah, have you seen him anywhere? Hmm, I don't think so. But I know that he really likes to hang out at the top of the waterfall. Maybe check up there? <gasps> okay, well, I guess we'll go to the top of the waterfall. Thank you so much, Elephant, and enjoy your lunch. Bye. Hello, birdie. Hi there. I'm not a birdie, I'm a parrot. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I thought that parrots were birds. Oh, we are birds, but we are the most intelligent bird species. So I prefer not to be called a birdie. Oh, wow. Well, I'm really sorry, parrot. But can I just say, I really like the color of your feathers. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. I'm a blue macaw. Just look at these feathers. Very beautiful. Hey, can you help us? We're looking for Panda and we heard that he hangs out up here. Nope, I haven't seen Panda all day. Hmm, but when he's not at the top of the waterfall, you can usually find him up on the gondola up there. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll keep going up. Thanks, Parrot, bye. Hmm. Well, I don't see Panda anywhere. Do you guys see Panda anywhere? Oh man. Well, what should we do now? You think we should go on the gondola? Oh, I don't know. That looks kind of scary, don't you think? I mean, it could be a really fun adventure though. Um, okay, let's do it. Phew, we made it. Hello up there. Did you hear that? I said, hello up there. Where is that coming from? Do you think it could be Panda? Oh, hello. Well, you're not Panda. No, I'm a lion. Can't you see my gorgeous mane? That's how you can tell I'm a boy lion. 
Well, hi, Wyatt. Well, I do like your mane. So, only boy lions have manes? Yes, but both boy and girl lions roar so loud that we can be heard over five miles away. Wow, that is really loud. Yeah, but if both boys and girls can roar really loud, but only boys have manes, well, is there anything that only the girl lions do? Oh yeah, lots. For instance, girl lions do most of the hunting to feed the pride. A pride is what we call our little family. Oh my goodness, that is really cool. So girl lions must be really strong and really fierce. Oh, they sure are. But what are you doing up there? Yeah, we're looking for someone. Um, can you help us? Of course I can. Who are you looking for? Yeah, so we're looking, my friends and I, are helping chimpanzee look for Fred. Do, do you know Fred? Oh yeah, I really like Fred. I saw him this morning by the waterfall. Did you check there? Yeah, we did, but we couldn't find him. And you didn't see him on the gondola? Nope. Huh. Well, I'm not sure where he could be. Maybe check below. I think the ranger is down there. He should know where Panda is. Okay, well, thanks, Lion. We'll go look for Ranger. Bye. All right, friends, let's go see if we can find the Ranger. Yeah, come on. Wow, this place is really nice. Oh, hey, do you think that's the ranger? Um, ex excuse me, um, but, but do you think you can help me and my friends? Hi there, how can I help you? Are, are you the ranger by chance? I sure am. I'm in charge of taking care of this wonderful place and making sure all of our animals are taken care of. Oh good, yeah, well we just spoke to Lion and he said that you might be able to help us. I can sure try, what do you need? Yay, well we encountered a chimpanzee earlier and he asked us to help him find his friend the panda and we have looked everywhere for him and we can't find him anywhere. Hmm, he's usually pretty easy to find. Let's see. Did you try by the pool? Yeah, and the hippopotamus said that um, he hasn't seen him. And the waterfall? Yep, and we also checked by the gondola, and both the elephant and the parrot said that they hadn't seen him either. Well, that just leaves one other place he could be. Pandas sleep most of the day between 10 and 16 hours, actually. So my guess is, if you can't find him, he's probably sleeping. 10 to 16 hours a day? Oh, that is a really long time to sleep. Oh yeah, if Panda isn't eating, he's sleeping. It's one of his favorite hobbies. Great. Well, can you tell us where he might be sleeping? Of course, come with me and we'll find him together. Did you hear that, friends? We're gonna use a little bit more teamwork to see if we can find ourselves a panda. Yeah, let's go. There he is. Oh, wow. <laughs> that does look like a panda, doesn't it? What do you think, explorers? Did we find our panda? Yeah, I agree. That's definitely our panda. Fred, Fred, it's time to get up, buddy. Ooh. What? Huh? Did I fall asleep again? Yeah, silly goose, you did. 
chimpanzee and our new friends have been looking all over for you. Oh man, I'm really sorry. I was eating bamboo and then I started to feel drowsy. So I closed my eyes for a second and, well, I must have fallen asleep. Oh, this is great. Well, we better find Chimpanzee and let him know that we found his friend. You found him. Great job, you guys. Thank you so much for your help. I should have guessed that he'd be sleeping. Oh, well, you're very welcome, Chimpanzee. We are always happy to help a friend in need, aren't we, friends? Yeah, it's, it's kind of what we do as friends. Thank you again. We're gonna go play now. You're welcome. Bye, have fun. <laughs> Thank you for helping find Panda today. Oh, that was so much fun. And teamwork is always a great way to solve problems, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, explorers. Well, that's the end of this adventure. But if you want to continue exploring, click the big red subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to give the bell a ring to get notifications so you're the first to know the next adventure that we're going on. Yeah. <laughs> All right, explorers. We'll see you next time. Bye.